Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carpool Gaming and another Cyberpunk video. That's right, we're back at it again with another amazing iconic weapon. This one is going to be a shotgun that you can easily miss called the Deserter. And today, I'm going to show you how you can get it as well. Let's go! Once again, thanks for watching everybody. And without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. We have a new iconic weapon. First thing first, in order to get this gig to pop up, the man who killed Jason Foreman, you're going to have to first meet Mr. Hands in person. Then all of these different gigs will show up. Now, once you make your way over here, you're going to have to wait on a bench between a certain hour to get this lady, Bree, to show up. Brianna. Now, after she shows up, you're going to kick back with her and chop it up about how you're going to help her out. Take the short, and now you need to make your way over to the next part of the quest. But before we do that, go into your journal and you need to crack the code. If you don't like the code that you got, you can just exit out of it and do it again. But once you crack the code, the quest will update, and now you need to go to the old motel. And guess where it's at? We're back in Pacifica. That's right, the same place where I did that video a couple days ago where you can get the cops not to spine in. Well, turns out it was part of a quest mission. Yep, and now we need to go inside of this hotel room where there is a ton of enemies, my dude. A ton. Like, it doesn't look like it's this big from, from the outside. So make your way all the way up to the top, taking out the enemies. And once you get all the way here, you will have a boss fight. Open up the door like so, and bam, out of the blue, this guy pops up. And he's pissed. And he's angry. And it's time to take the dude out. So that's what we're going to do. Now I'm using my baby, Boomer. Check out that video right there if you want to check out that. It is really, really nice. I've been rocking this more than my katana lately, which is kind of strange. After you finish taking a boss out, head back into the room. And here is the guy. Yep, we need to confront and render. So, here's the thing, throughout this whole part, they're gonna keep giving you the option to shoot them. Do not shoot them or you won't get the iconic. They're gonna keep giving you the option to shoot them. Do not shoot them. Sit down, chop it up with them, but do put a gun to his head, all right? After you put the gun to his head, this is kinda gonna make him spit out what we want, and that is the location for his stash, and he's gonna give it to us. He's also gonna give us a code to the garage where we need to head to. Now, I'm not sure if you can just head over to the garage and use this code, but, you know, try it out. Maybe you can, because it, it does seem like you can just go over here and pick up this iconic if you did indeed have the code. So, from here, the quest is gonna update. It's gonna turn into a new quest called Addicted to Chaos. From here, you wanna make your way over to the garage and put in the code that the guy gave you, 1975. From here, just open it up and you got the brand new iconic legendary shotgun called the deserter it's a powered double barrel shotgun and compared to the order it's actually better on paper you got 85 percent headshot damage the order has 50 and it has more damage as well the cool thing about this is when you neutralize the enemy it's going to set them on fire and you as well but you get a little speed boost and increased mitigation chance when your health is low so I took it over to one of my favorite places to try out Webby Specifica. And it actually performed really, really well. I had a lot of fun with it, and every time you shoot, it will send enemies on fire. For sure. It usually takes two shots to take down any red bar, so, you know, pretty good. If you're looking to get a, a shotgun that's probably one of the best in the game, look, all you have to do is make sure you don't shoot that guy. <laughs> And you can get this iconic weapon. It is really, really good. And that is how you're going to get it in Cyberpunk 2077. But for right now, that's pretty much going to for the video. I hope you truly enjoyed it. As always, if you're new to the channel, how you doing? And welcome. Don't forget to subscribe. Right here at Carpool Game. Upload a wide variety of videos range from updates, tips and tricks, guys and news, and a whole lot more. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Once again, thank you everybody for all your love and support. And as always, I'll be seeing y'all guys in the next one. Later.